I'm a racer and I know it. I'm a racer and I know it. Hello and welcome, racer fans, to another episode of This Week in Racer Soccer. My name is James Lowry, and as always, I'm joined by Coach Beth Ackerman. Coach, nice to have you. Thank you. This past weekend, soccer had an OVC doubleheader with Friday at SEMO and Sunday at UT Martin. Coach, why don't you tell us about the SEMO game on Friday? Well, obviously, the start of the SEMO game, the first half was uh, really hard for us. We uh, Obviously, it was a 6-0 at halftime, so nowhere close to where we were expecting to start that one. Um, I think there was some lack of... Um, some mistakes defensively, players aren't tracking uh, the right people and uh, obviously with that happening there were six goals in the back of the net. Uh, second half we actually ended up tying them 0-0 so for me I was more encouraged with the fact that the team could hang with them. Um, I, I feel like uh, we came off on Sunday and really reacted a lot differently against UT Martin which was good to see. Now that game on Sunday, much closer match. Tell us what happened in that one. Well, we started really well. Uh, obviously, Veronica got a penalty in the first two minutes of the game. She drove really hard into the box and then got taken down. So for us, it was something that, that we were looking for to have a good reaction coming off that, obviously, Friday's loss. Um, I'd say the start of the game was amazing. The last part of the game was amazing. Obviously, we gave up two goals in the second half, and I really was encouraged to think that we might be able to tie that one back up. We got some really good chances towards the end there, but uh, just couldn't get the ball in the back of the net. Now, Veronica Proboslavska in that game, that penalty kick was her sixth goal of the season? Yeah, she's done really well for us. Obviously, anyone stepping up to take a penalty is, is kind of a tough thing to do. So as a senior, we kind of called on her to do it. And uh, she put it in uh, the back of the net, which is all we needed. And uh, that obviously led us into the game 1-0. It wasn't until the second half that we got um, the other two goals against us. All right, now this coming Friday at 3 p.m. at Cutchin Field, you've got your next OVC match against Belmont. They're new to the conference. What are you looking for in this match? Well, for us, I just need a reaction off of this weekend. We, we're one and two now in conference. We need to get points. We know Belmont's going to come in here and give us a hard game. Uh, we're going to be training hard again this week to really fire the girls up. Um, the conference really, right now, we, we, we're young. The, the points are still there to be had. So we've got seven games left, and we're really going to be pushing the girls to, to hopefully get a result on Friday. Now, you're coming back to Cutchin Field. Do you think that'll boost your team a little bit? Well, I think it's always nice to come home, and obviously our supporters have been great during the season, so I think the girls will be really fired up to, to you know, perform well on our home field again. Um, being away this, this last weekend is tough to play two good teams away, so now we'll just be coming back to, to go up against another good Belmont team. And there you have it, Racer fans. Racer Soccer back in action Friday, 3 p.m. at Cutchin Field against Belmont. Come out on the hill. We look to see you there. As always, I am James Lowry, joined by Coach Beth Ackerman. Thank you for watching, and you all have a great day.